Alright, well that's it for all the bikers, I think. Let me double check. Seems so, yep. I'm just gonna... Oh yeah, I forgot. If I let go here, I'll go down. But I think if I hold B... Yeah, B is like braking on your bike. I remember that. You heading to Fusha? Fusha should be another pretty easy gym. Because I think Fusha is home to Koga, the ninjas. And they use potion type attacks. So if I'm gonna use Wakey, he's just gonna wreck all of these Pokemon. That was a pretty good hit there, Weezing. Not good enough. Just rotating my Pokemon. Uh, let's go... Wakey again, I guess. Psychic, I think. I think Psychic might be the best Psychic attack. Or Tri-Beam. Tri-Beam or Psychic, I'm not really sure. I'm betting it's Psychic. I'm not sure if coughing no self is destruct. Gotta watch out, man. Taking a lot of damage here. It's because I need to feed Cloud Strife experience, so whoever comes up next is taking massive amounts of damage. Gonna heal up a little bit. Start. First, use the antidote. Luckily, I'm quite stacked with super potions right now. That was all in uh, preparation for Snorlax. Though we didn't need that many for Snorlax, luckily. Also, gonna heal up Cloud Strife. So, it was already level 28, so just in a short time, we got three levels on him. Pretty sweet. Gonna go up here for a second, there we go. Just gonna run around to the repel runs off, because I wanna capture a Pokemon in that grass. There we go. I have to check if this is considered Route 16 or not. Town map. No, this is considered this is considered Route 17. Which is good. So I can capture whatever comes here now. A Spearow? I don't have a Spearow yet. It's not the Pokemon I would really want it, but hey, it's another Pokemon. I can actually weaken it. Quick attack. Just don't kill it, Cloud. Do not kill it. Oh, it, it, this thing has mirror move. Here's the Gen 1. 40... Gen 1, 40 self-destruct normal. On the 30... I have no idea what that means, man. That's very unclear what you just copied there. There we go. Cut a Spearow. What are we gonna name the Spearow? Okay, so level 40. Alright. Well, I need, a, I need a name for Spearow here. Because we just, cop just captured him. You have any good names, uh, Jake?
<laughs> Dirty bird. <laughs> I like that one. Another Spearow? No, the other one didn't. I only have one Spearow. Captain Jack. Captain Jack Spearow. <laughs> Dirty bird. <laughs> Uh, another Spiro, Jake Spiro. What deleted run? I don't know any deleted run. I think you're confused with someone else. I'll go with Dirty Bird, because th that's kind of true, man. It's kind of like the dirty version of uh, a Pidgey. <laughs> Unless you're referring to something else, and I'm just oblivious about it. Dirty Bird. You there. What do you want, kiddo? I want to battle you. I want to rob you of all your Pokemon and your money. Q-Ball wants to fight. Machop. I wonder if we can take down this Machop. Let's see. Uh, actually... Uh, I don't think I'm gonna... Does low... I'm not sure. Does fighting ty Are fighting types good against normal type Pokemon? Or is it just fighting types? <laughs> Machoke. This is the first Machoke we see. go with bite yeah I remember I think I named your uh, your Spiro dead or it was Rick I don't know when are you continuing your runs by the way Jake it's been a while since you did your uh, gold run her gold I think it was go away machoke beat it whoa wait your Jake Spiro already died there's no money in fighting, kids. Oh, you wanna bet? I have, I think, 15 times as much gold as you have. You cue ball. Mankey. Alright. I like the fighting stance of Mankey. It's like he's doing that, uh, flying crane kick from Karate Kid. Hi, Mankey. Cubo wants to use Primeape. I haven't seen the Primeape yet. He looks cool, man. He looks so much better than Mankey. Just his eyes are a bit strange, but... Probably should be careful with Fishrick here. He's going with Leer. Sure, I'll take it. Have at ya. Fury swipes. This might hurt. Two times. Okay, never mind. Just died already. There we go. I guess I gotta keep healing my uh, Gyarados because it does take a lot of damage from being swapped out every time just so I can level up Cloud Stripe a little bit. Her 
already beat you, sir? I did. So I'm gonna zigzag, just in case I forget anyone here. Okay, so here's where the path splits up. Right, so it splits into three routes here. First, let's battle this guy. We're bikers, highway stars. Well, what I said, Rick, once I beat this one, the green one, um, I definitely would like to try a dual stream where you could play Pokemon Red and I'll play Pokemon Blue or something like that. You can always stream. I mean, I have so much content I need to upload that I could just do that while watching you instead of you watching me. This guy's got a level 33 muck. Oh, why did it become so tiny? What's wrong with it? It's a tiny muck. Dragon Rage. There we go. Does Dragon Rage always hit? I think it does. So it's kind of like swift, I think, in that matter. Right, let's take the west route first. I need a little exercise. Here we go. He's got four Pokemon. Okay, I think uh, Cloud Strife might be able to take some down some of these. Let's go, quick attack. Fury Swipes. Fury Swipes is quite a different, quite a powerful attack. There we go, good hit. Scratch. Okay, the first round is mine. Beat that, Mankey. Eat it. Send another Mankey. Sure, I'll take it. I think Fury Swipes can hit up to five times. Yeah, like that. Stop. Critical hit, good one there. Cloud Strive grew to level 29, sweet. Machoke, alright, keep Cloud Strive in. Then switch him out for Fishrick, there we go. What, what was your progress, uh, Jake, in uh, Pokemon Herd Gold? Did you get past the second gym already? I enjoy to watch your streams and keep your box active. Yeah, man, I don't have many. I don't have that many viewers yet. I got a few. I got a few viewers on this uh, video today, actually. We got uh, Jose, or Jose, uh, Rick. Jake, my wife, we got uh, Fizzy, we got Stanley, just hit Goldenrod, about to take on the fur gym, Goldenrod City, oh man, it's been ages since I played gold, I don't even know the, the gym leaders anymore, it was Goldenrod, I think that was an electric type gym, wasn't it? Oh, great. Thanks for doing that, Rick. Oh, yeah, we had Randy as well. Sorry, I almost forgot that. 
Randy dropped by for a second as well. Problem is, most of my viewers, they're actually not from Europe, so they have different watch times than we do. I think Golden Rot was electric. I'm not sure, though. Cue ball, woo, good workout. Flowers got 650 for winning. Alright, what's in here? Route 17, Sutherland City, Fuchsia City. Okay, now I gotta go up. This is gonna take a while. Trainer tips. Press the A or B button to stay in place while on a slope. Yeah, I knew that. I knew that. Trainer tips. All Pokemon are unique. Even Pokemon of the same type and level grow at different rates. So many tips here. It's a notice. Watch out for discarded... Oh, man. You're going to tell me there's discarded items here? I'm not gonna search for them unless I have a an item finder, I suppose. Probably should heal my Pokemon up. Fishrick, there we go. Ah, uh, yeah, I shared it to like 10 groups and a few groups. Pachata? What's Pachata? And thanks for sharing. I just don't know what Pachata is. No clue. I beat it one gym and lost a Pokemon. Chat's no idea what my phone is doing. You can fly. Look, that's Voltorp's electric. Electri Sorry, guys. Let Voltorp electrify you. There we go. It's not that hard. Yeah, I don't trust these Voltorps, though. These things would probably explode. So I'm gonna go straight to Marcus. I don't trust these things at all. Yeah, I, I forgot actually. I forgot all about Portal Knights. We should pr probably be doing that as well. Oh, this Sonic Boom is dangerous, man. Sonic Boom always does 20 damage. Doesn't even matter what level it is. There we go. Goodbye, Voltor. First things first, man. I'm gonna heal up before this thing self-destructs. Light screen. That's for special attacks? Yeah, it is. I'm not sure if Voltorp already knows self-destruct at 29, but I'm pretty sure it does. It's like one of his first moves he learns. Crazy ball. Good night, Voltorp. Critical hit. I like the fact that Razor Leaf always crits. My Pokemon won't evolve. Why? Well, either you need to trade them, or you probably have to use a stone on them, or they're just not happy with you. Machoke. Uh, was Machoke one of those Pokemon you had to trade for him a champ? Was that the reason? I don't remember. Substitute normal bar accuracy PP10. Accuracy takes one for max HP. Evolve Machoke. Machoke. Yeah, let's go with Fishrick. I think Machoke was one of those trading Pokemon. Water gun. Horn drill, explosion, cell destruct, substitute more killing attacks. What do you mean with substitute more? What, what do you mean with substitute? One drill explosion.
Be a rebel. There's so many bikers here, man. I guess it's good experience. I'm not really complaining. Just surprised there's so many of them. Kubo wants to fight. Kubo sends out Primate. Um, I guess I'm gonna keep going with Fishrick. Substitute user takes one fourth its max HP to put in. Yeah, like I said, I still really don't know what that means. This guy keeps lowering my defense. That's kind of scary, man. I have no idea what it's trying to do. Fish rig grew to level 35. I'll keep Fishrick in. Why are these Pokemon trying to lower my defense? Uh oh, here it goes. Okay, not that bad, not that bad. I guess if he critted it would be bad with my lowered defense. Right, let me stand on top of him so I don't write down. There we go. Let me heal up Fisherick. I also can't swim yet. I mean, I can't surf yet, so I'm kind of curious as to which route I'm on right now. Where's my town map? There we go. Still 17. Because it looks like those dots, it looks like that's a part I have to swim. Which I don't think I can yet, so... Wait, did I just miss something? I did, okay. Nice bike, how's the handle? Because I fought on the left side, the left side I took. Um, was already all the way at the bottom, apparently it wasn't, so... I have to go back again. Sludge. Sludge is such a dangerous attack, man. Look at it. That Pokemon is not cool, man. Weezing is kind of dangerous here, man. Probably should have gone straight for Wakey here. Kind of running out of PP on my Gyarados as well. Muck. I'm just gonna stay with Wakey. We're trying to potion all my Pokemon here. Alright, Jake, see you in a bit. Going shop this late? It's already like 9 o'clock. Nice. Psychic. Here we go. Um, I'm gonna remove Pound. Learn Psychic. One of the strongest Psychic attacks. See you soon, Jake. Let me use my antidotes. I want to use it on Fishrick. And I want to use it on Wakey. Using so many potions here, man. Normally I don't even bother with all these items and I just let my Pokemon faint. Since we're doing Nuzlocke, that's no longer an option. Let me heal, uh, whatever his name is, Cloud Strife as well. Hmm. 
Okay, so this is where we stopped. Now we have two routes. We got left and right. Let me go left first. I know they all lead south. Okay, so this is the end. There's still a biker here. Let's do it. Get lost, kid. I'm bushed. Biker wants to fight. This guy has a lot of Pokemon, so probably can take down a few of them with the uh, Cloud Strife. The more Pokemon they have, the lower their level tends to be. Wow, that did absolutely no damage whatsoever. my controller one moment here there we go Just turning on the PS5 for a second so I can use it and then put it into sleep mode so I can use its USB to charge. Cloud Strive grew to level 30, sweet. Now actually quick attack is... Ooh, this is wheezing. I'm not gonna use Cloud Strive on the wheezing, man. Even though it's on... Well, maybe I could. Let me see how far we'll get. Because this would give us a lot of experience if we can take him down solo. But they are quite scary, man, these wheezings. Tackle is, uh, I mean, Tackle does a little less damage than Quick Attack. Quick Attack is slightly stronger, if only just a little bit. Look how long it's gonna take. No, 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 I'm not gonna change Pokemon yet. I want to beat this one, at least one. See how much experience we're going to get. Yeah, I'm potion. That was to be expected. Is it? Because I thought it was the other way around. There we go, 925 experience. Summon Fishrick. Wakey, Fishrick, there we go. I don't think we're gonna encounter that many more bikers here, because we killed already a lot. Or we beat. We don't kill people, we beat people. No PP left on water gun. Let's go. I mean, no PP left on bite. That just shows how much of these battles we've been doing in a row, man. We're running out of PP everywhere. Let me use Ebon. Ebon is actually the lowest one in age in the level right now. Maybe Ebon can take a few down. Uh, fly. Oh man, it, it really his fly attack missed. Really? Yeah, that's why I'm saving all my hyper potions, all my max potions and whatever. I'm saving everything I can that's like really high heal and really high end healing, I mean. Wheezing, I'm not gonna change yet. There we go, now we change. Max, like elixirs, uh, max potions, hyper potions, those are the ones I'm gonna keep. As well as my Evers, like the ones that restore PP. I'm gonna save all of those as much as possible. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. PP recovery to elixirs. Uh, elixirs and uh, ethers. You can buy those. I know you can buy them before you go into the Elite Four. There's like a little uh, store there that sells every item that a store has to sell. But in order to save some money, I'm also saving all those high-end healing items. Man, these Pokemon, they sure love to potion me, etc. Huh? Oh, I have another Pokemon that potioned? There we go, Cloud Strife. I forgot about him. Sorry, buddy. Right, just double, double checking. Yeah, I beat him already. We're still going down. I thought we were near the end. Cycling road. Slope ends here. Alright. Nice. Cycling road is uphill, all from here. Better go, Diamond. I'm looking for slow, bro. Want to trade one for Licky Tongue? No thanks. Um, what? Where are we exactly now? Route 18. Okay. So I wonder if there's any grass here. There is, alright, so... Agent of Southern City, Fuchsia City. Did we already fight these trainers? I don't remember. No, I guess not. So that means we can fight, we can capture a Pokemon here. I always check every grassy area for new Pokemon. Bird Pokemon, great. I don't have any lightning attacks yet. Go with Wakey. Let's try this psychic attack out. The strongest psychic attack there is, I think. Boom. Bye. Wow, the experience is crap on that one. I guess because it was just a Spiro. Fero looks cool, man. I like the looks of the Fero in this game. Growl. Sure, you're gonna lower my attack. Psychic is strong enough to kill you anyway. Probably one hit. There we go. One of it. Yep. Psychic is really powerful. And I like how you only get like 300 for a Spiro, but like a thousand for the Fero. Flowers got 725 for winning. Um, are we near the city? Okay, we're in the city already. So I'm gonna heal up first because my Pokemon are like out of health, out of PP, out of everything. And that right there was, I think that was, uh, I think I just saw the Safari Zone. How do we get there? How do we get to the Poké Center, I mean? Here we go. Don't worry, I'll go back to beat those trainers and uh, catch the Pokémon there. But I first want to heal up. Because my Pokémon beat a lot of trainers there. Jump off the ledge, go up, go west. This is my turf, get out of here.
I think one of these had a Dodio or Dodrio. Jack Sparrow, go clout! Don't lower my attack, it's already low enough, man. It's about to send a Spiro. Fury attacks. That's a multiple hit, isn't it? Yeah, it is. There we go. Critical hit. Sweet. Cloud Strife. I think I got Thundershock now. Nice. There we go. Say goodbye to your birdies, man. Yeah, now I'm feeling confident to take out the Pharaoh. See ya. Just in time as well. Now we finally have a full, legitimate Thunder Pokemon, or Lightning Pokemon, Electric Pokemon, if you will. Now it's no longer a normal type, or an Electric type that only knows normal moves. And our first random encounter on this route. A Dotio, nice! I'm gonna get that thing. I don't want to kill it, so just a normal tackle will do. Back. It's not very effective. I could do another tackle. Just hope it doesn't crit. Okay, that's enough. I'm not gonna do anything more. From here on out, I'm just gonna throw balls at it. Close, I thought we had it, man. Let's throw another ball at it. And I caught it. Nice, we need a name for Dodio, man. Twin bird. So I have actually a few names I could teach. I, I could I could name this dude uh, Hydra because it has multiple heads. Or we call it, we can call it Dodriotos, like Doritos, but then Dodriotos. Or maybe at at and Eddie. Does that fit? At at and Eddie. Let me see. At. Wait. Add. Add. That does fit, man. <laughs> Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Because once it evolves, it has three hats. Which, which name do you think we should go for? Keep him at Adenetti. There we go. <laughs> Truth be told, though, I'm not really sure if we're gonna use. I don't think. Okay, I'll be honest. We're not going to use him. He'll just be stuck inside the box anyway. Look, there it is. At Adenetti. He's pretty high level, man. 
Thunder Shock. Ooh, luckily it missed. I was afraid that Fury Attack would kill me. There we go. Bye, Ed, Ed, and Eddie. That's a lot of experience, man. Jeez. Like 1150? Well, that... We got... We passed through that, so... Now, um, we could also take the other route first before we do the, the gym. Route 12 to 15. Basically, this route. Let's do that first so we can get a little bit of extra experience. So we're going to go to Lavender Town. And we'll go south from Lavender Town. I also know we still need to do the uh, few, uh, whatever city it's called to the left of here. I want to see. I think there's only one Pokemon that still needs in uh, evolving from our team. And that's Ebon. Because Jolteon technically is already evolved. Ebon is still a Pidgeotto, so we have Chonk here. We got Marcus. Okay. Actually, yeah, let's save. Good job, Rick. Let me also save on the emulator. There we go. Um, this is gonna be our end team, I think, unless we get another really good Pokemon. I might change Pidgeotto. So we have, because this is two normal type Pokemon. We got Psychic, we got Water, we got Grass, we got Lightning. I kind of would like a Fire, replace one of the normal type Pokemon for Fire. Kind of like Snorlax. But his defense is actually quite low. 48 for level 30. 48, 48. Let's compare that to Cloud Strife. 49. Okay, that's still about the same. Yeah, he's got 74. He's, he's, the defense on Gyarados is way higher. Same with uh, Ivysaur. The, the thing that Snorlax has going for him is his attack and um, HP. But his defense is actually quite low. Meaning he'd still take a lot of damage. How about Ebon? Defense 43. Are you telling me Ebon has more defense than Snorlax? No, not yet. We'll keep it for now. This is probably the best Pokemons I have. The ones that are in my team right now. So, uh, unless we find anything better, we're just going to keep these. I'd be okay trying to beat the game with what we have right now. The Buzzard Pokemon. No? Kinda need to know which TM is Ice Beam. Poke Flute, rare. I don't think we need Poke Flute anymore. I'm just gonna keep it. Rare Candy, deposit, yep. Sylph Scope, I don't think we need that one anymore. Don't think we need the HM anymore. Elixirs. HP up. Nugget. I'll just deposit the nugget for now. X accuracy. And ice heals. Yeah, let's also drop this one then. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think. This is Ice Beam. Again, I'm not sure. Item. No, it's Rock Slide. Okay. That's 49. Flowers PC. 
deposit item. 48. Withdraw. You know, I think even Snorlax could learn Ice Beam. Not entirely sure, but I think Snorlax was one of those Pokemon that can learn a lot of TMs. Ah, no, he can't. Wait, Fisher can't even learn Ice Beam. Only Wakey can. That's a shame. I thought I could learn Ice... Wait. Maybe 49 is not even Ice Beam, is it? Let's try attack. All right. Which is also a very, very, very powerful attack. But I don't know which one is Ice Beam then, so I'm just gonna... Leave that for now. Maybe it's... F the only option I have left is 38. No, I forgot. I don't know which one is... TM13, maybe? That one is Ice Beam, there we go. Let's learn it to Fish Rick. See, even Chunk is able to learn Ice Beam. I guess. Welcome back, Jake. Um, you know what? I'm gonna hold on to Ice Beam. Because I forgot. That's actually one of the, the, the plus sides to having Snorlax. Snorlax can learn a lot of TMs. I knew he could learn Ice Beam. Not gonna teach it yet. So, so we beat we beat the bicycle route. Now we're gonna go south from Lavender Town. Um, what we got here? Route twelve, north Lavender. How do you do, sir? There's a lookout spot upstairs. Let's see, because usually here's some people that give you items. How about you, ma'am? My Pokemon Ashes are stored in Pokemon Tower. You can have this, TM. I don't need it anymore. What is it? Swift. Ah, I was just mentioning that. It's very accurate, so use it during battles. She can't afford to lose. Swift always hits. Flying Pokemon, Pokemon that are dug underground, it will hit. Fortunately, the power is not that powerful. Um, who are we gonna level? Ah, oh, yeah, Ebon. These will probably use a lot of water Pokemon. Yeah, I got a bite here. Do, 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 do. Is he gonna send out Magikarps? No, Golding. This thing knows Horn Drill, though. But it's only 22. So I guess this is a good experience for uh, Ebon. It's not gonna work. I need this thing to be a Pidgeot man. It will get a good boost to his status. Poliwag? What is that poly roll there? I'm surprised. Poliwag is quicker than my Pidgeotto. I'm genuinely surprised there. Be right back, guys. Need to open the door for a sec.
Alright, we're back. So this polywog was surprisingly quick. Ebon gained a level. Sweet. I have no idea what level Ebon evolves though. Let's fly away. Wait there, there, if you're right. If you right click your window capture for emulator on Streamlabs source bar, then go to properties and click an option to show cursor doesn't show. Oh. Yeah, I could, technically I could just do that, right? And then you don't see it. Wait. Let me check. Can you guys see the cursor? Yes, you can. Okay, that's actually better. Yeah, you're right. I will do that in the future. I'm just going to put it in the corner now. I didn't realize it was just in the middle of the screen. Can you send that, that little text you sent? Can you send it to our Facebook chat? So I can, uh, so I remember it. Because by the end of this stream, this message will probably be hidden somewhere and I'll have to find it. Or I can do it now. Let's. Well, let me save quickly. There we go. And then go to OBS. Right click on your window capture for your emulator. Game capture. Right click your window capture for your emulator or streamlet or on, uh, on streamlet source bar, then go to properties. I don't have properties though. There we go, properties. Let me check, I'm doing it right now. Uh, use uh, capture cursor, turn off, done. Alright, never mind. I just did it already, so you guys shouldn't be able to see my cursor now. Be patient. Fishing is a waiting game. I suck at waiting, man. Tentacool. I think Pijotto is at like level 32 then. I got potioned. Awesome. Not really. Yeah, actually I didn't know that already, so thanks for letting me know. I need to use the antidote. Where's my, uh, you know what? Let me kill this one quickly. Where's my super potions? There we go. Yeah, you keep tail whipping me. I'll just fly away. Bye. how these trainers are slightly weaker than what we faced before so it's easier for my Pijotto to level up oh there's another one the fishing fool versus Pokemon kid I like how this guy just called himself fool Fly. Oh, so when you do uh, 
exclamation mark notify. You get, is that like the command to uh, get updates about when someone goes live? Is that how it works? Sweet, level 29. I'm surprised you don't get those messages immediately. So it's kind of like the notification bell in, in YouTube, I suppose. You know, um, Jake, we actually caught a dodio in the previous route, and we decided to name it Ed, Ed, and Eddie, but I'm not sure if you know that cartoon. So we got a dodio called Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Not sure if that was a thing in the UK. I'm really unfamiliar with the commands on Facebook. Which one is... What, what does Clip60 mean? Getting good XP here for Pichotto. So basically it, it, it cuts the last set. Uh, if you use clip, does it start recording for 60 seconds? Or it takes the last 60 seconds of the recording? This is where we beat Snorlax, so we weren't able to progress any further than this so far. Um, let me double check. Which route is this? Is there any route between Lavender Town? Okay, where's 11? Wait. 11. 10. Okay, so basically what we just passed through was Route 12. Which is the route where we captured Snorlax. So... This one... From here it should be a different route. Is that how it works? No, still Route 12. Alright. We got a lot of backtracking to do soon because I think in this house we can get our good rod. So we could go technically go back to every city and start fishing there for water Pokemon. Or I might want to wait till we get the um Might want to wait till we get the Ultra Rod or Super Rod, I believe. Oh wait, we do get the super rod in here, I think. Critical hit. Well, he's dead. Oh, this guy's got an electrode. Let me instantly psychic him before he decides to destroy himself. See ya, electrode. Good knowing you. I'm the fishing guru's brother. I simply love fishing. Do you like to fish? I do. Grant, I like your style. Take this and fish on one. I received a super rod.
Is I'm a bit confused. Is Super Rod the best rod you can get in this game in this game? Or is there an ultra rod? I think there was a third rod, but I'm confused now. I forgot we don't have... Oh man, don't tell me I have to go back. I do. <sighs> yep, this is my mistake. I left HMO1 in our computer. And I also took out the Pokemon that learned HM1. So we're gonna have to go back, do a little backtracking here. In the meantime, let me check if... Super Rot was the best Rot in Generation 1. I think I can get the other one in the... Uh, what do they call this? The, the area where you can't battle Pokemon, just capture them. Safari Zone, there we go. Yeah, but Marcus could, I could teach Marcus HM1, but the problem was I left HM1 in my computer. So I had to go back either way. So there's an old rod, there's a good rod, and there's a super rod. We just got the super rod. So this is the best one there is. So we can also backtrack to the cities to um, to get some water Pokemon. Let's see, HM01, this one. Can Snorlax learn cut? Just Marcus. Um, I'm gonna teach Marcus cut. Cut is a decent attack, I suppose. You know what I'm going to replace it with? Tackle. <clears throat> so I just replaced this normal attack with another pretty about the same amount of damage move attack. So after we reach the other city, so once we pass through this entire route of 12 to 15, then I will probably... Um, yeah, start fishing. Do some uh, backtracking to the cities. At least the ones where we didn't get a Pokemon yet. I'm not a huge fan of Sunbeam. It's powerful, yeah, but it takes two turns. There's moves that could kill Pokemons in one turn, so yeah, not a huge fan of it, to be honest. You never know what you could catch. <laughs> Magic Carp, really? Maybe this guy also has a Gyarados. I forgot at what level Magic Carp turns into. Uh, was it 26 Gyarados? I don't remember. Starts using Splash, really. Go away, man. Useless Pokemon. 
I mean, even even its XP is useless. I get 102. Well, it wasn't enough to level up Pujato, though. What do we get? Iron. I'll take that any day. Thank you, good sir. Surprised you didn't take it. Maybe he was. Maybe he had that item laying on the floor to lure me in. To battle his magic carps. Friggin' magic carps, go away, man. Have you found Moonstone? Yeah, I got like four of them. But I can't do anything with them. Super nerd? No, no. Youngster. Junior trainer. Ah, uh, now I know why he wants the Moonstone. He probably has a Nidorina. Or Nidorino. I'll bet you he has a Nidorino. I told you, he has a Nidorino. That's why he wants the Moonstone. You can only get a Nido King slash Nido Queen. With a Moonstone. I don't think I healed at the Pokemon Station, by the way. You said slash save and slash heal. I will save, but I don't think I healed. I didn't really need it. But let me save just in case. Can never have too many saves. What route are we on right now? Gotta keep using that town map. Still route 12. So I'm not allowed to capture in this grass area. Because this is where we... Killed... Uh, Snorlax. Snorlax. 